A little bit. Oh my god. I'm to our new truck. Yeah. My truck that I'm loaning. Oh. You guys. Woo. I got stuck. Alright. And bring it in. Bring it in. Ceremony. So I'm a nerd, and that's what we're gonna do with the truck. Yeah. All right. We're gonna work. We're, we're, that, that'll be announced at the end. All right. So we're gonna begin with the first call to attention. Stand by. So this is so much more than a truck. This represents our entire community. It represents our students, our parents, and everybody who's been here for the last 33 years to make this program what it is and put it in a position that we can have beautiful things like this and do great things wherever we go. I want to thank a couple people. I want to thank Mark Yoder for heading up our fundraising efforts and accompanying me to go pick it up from the shady Russian thing we got it from. Thank you to James Jordan, Eric Ostreich, Irma Connolly, Carrie Wong, Christian Lau, Matt Cavanaugh, Eric Hill, Nicole Dobson, and everybody else who slaved away in the heat this summer to outfit it and build the inside. Thank you. Probably most of all, the man who's really just taken ownership of this project and designed and built the whole inside. We need to thank Mr. Luis Gonzalez. Yeah. 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 That's my dog. <laughs> all right, and thank you, of course, to all of our students. You guys are the reason that we are here doing this in the first place. So thank you guys just for being awesome. Okay. Did I miss one? Yes, you did. Sorry. We have it. We have a ceremony. Oh, yep, Matthew. What's that? Ben, ten, hut! Hey! Can you see it? Carefully.
Our keynote address will be delivered by Mark Yoder and Luis Gonzalez. Oh yeah. Mm. Oh yeah. Guys, six months ago, this was a dream. It was a thought that we're tired of running U-Hauls and returning them at 3 in the morning and you guys getting back when you're tired and unloading. And we thought, we said, we need to do something to help all the kids. And we started a fundraising, John, when we start fundraising? Uh, in March. March, we had a goal. $16,000. We found a trailer. We needed to raise it. Two months from the middle of March to the middle of May, we raised $16,000. You guys helped with fundraisers. You talked to people. We reached out to businesses. And this is a reality. Thank your parents who came here every Saturday morning and then Saturdays and Thursday afternoons on the hottest summer I've ever experienced in Central Florida, and we work, and there's some sweat equity in this. And I want to thank this man sitting right here behind me. My job was to get what he needed. His job was to figure out how to do it. I want to thank Timber Creek, in Winter Park for letting us come look at their trailers for yeah, ideas. Right. They were very helpful, very supportive, and I thank them for that. But he took that, what we saw, and made it real. I just helped them get people and stuff to put it together. And I know there are kids out here who help put screws, who learned how to use a drill. I saw you out here. My own daughter was one of them. Thank you for everybody that helped, for everybody that supported, for everybody that went to Publix, and the car washes, and the other fundraisers. This is the reality of what you did. And we did this for one reason. It's for the kids. That's why we did it. What do you want to say? Well, he practically said the whole thing, right? So, um, um, but yes, um, I want to thank Mr. Brown Willis to give me the opportunity to like work on the um, on the truck for you guys. Uh, if for people that don't know, I've been here 11 to 12 years, my last year. Um, so, um, I'm really proud of you guys. I know you got a bunch of you guys helping um, my team. This man right here. Mark, he's been here two years. Yes? It's my second year. Second year. This guy has done a lot more than anybody else I've seen. So you have to thank him. So, yeah. he's, he's great. so um, again, I, like I said, James, Christian, Doug, I mean, Matt, all these guys have been here every week, every Saturday. And I know I've done stuff on the side that people don't know. There's been stuff done behind the scenes that not a lot of people do, you know? So, yeah, big effort, and I want to thank everybody. Yeah! 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 yeah. 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 Fan 10, hut, hit! Now, we don't need everybody to move to the back, but the guard captains and our operations officer are raising the flag over the trailer as we speak. Okay, while they do that, our brass captain is here with the invocation. Yeah. Stand by. Got on my What? Sure. That's yeah. Three kids in the
pray for uh, If y'all don't mind, we're going to pray really quick. So if you bow your heads and close your eyes, yes, sir. we're going to pray. Yes, sir. Um, Almighty God, uh, let your blessing be upon this truck and upon the community it represents. Grant us good success, form our characters and virtue, and keep us under your protection at all times. In the mighty name of Jesus, everybody said, Amen! Amen. All right. Our woodman captain will now present the christening elements. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I got it, I got it. Okay. It is my solemn privilege <laughs> to present yeah. our drum major a can of Monster Energy. Yeah. Yeah. We're now going to move to the front. We're going to move to the front. Okay. You're not a kid that would steal it. Yeah, you are, Carla. minutes, but happy occasions sometimes call for a little bit of ceremony. All right. Yeah! Uh, all right. Uh, pit should be over there by your instruments getting ready to load those on. Where should battery be? We have Battery is pretty much done, right? Because we're not loading tonight, okay? <laughs> Horn line, if your instruments go on the truck, get them in cases and they need to, we're there. And they need to be on the other side of the truck, so instruments in cases on the far side. Once you have your, case, your instrument in a case, just get in a group over there. I still need to explain how it all works. Okay, and any other questions about where you need to be? We're packed. What? We're packed. We'll figure it out. Okay. All right. Mr. Brown. If your instrument does not go on the truck, uniforms are shake off. You! I think we're going to figure those out in the morning. Okay. Uh, we're going we're gonna to test load. If your instrument does not go on the truck for now, understand that your, uh, your uniform will, but we're not doing that part tonight. Okay? Yes. Yes. 
Uh, if there's room, altos will go on. That's one thing we're trying to figure out right now. Okay, your instruments and cases, get on the other side of the truck to load them, hit in the back, and there we go. Good man. Good. So just try to get each of the groups as they're working. Pit um, the marimbas and vibraphones will be getting their instruments ready. The scaffolding will get torn down.